What's good, y'all? It's your boy Ross back at it again with another video. So, ah, she has returned, y'all. Kazumi returns with a friend and tells another insane King Bang story. Now, I've reacted to her on a No Jumpers podcast maybe a few months back, and she um, was very explicit on certain things that she gets into, and she is ultimately for the streets but it seems like uh she is back to uh, grace us with another another story another one of her life stories and i'm pretty sure um she will still be for the streets you know what i'm saying and i'm not here to judge anybody you do what you do you know what i'm saying in your free time it's your life you live it but you know at some point you gotta be like yo man like is this really what my life is about to amount to? Is this what people are going to remember me as? Someone that was super mega for the streets. I don't know. But, hey, if if she's okay with it, apparently she's making some good money off of it. So, I'm pretty sure she's not tripping over the situation. Then it works for her. But, you know, hey, man. Till we just on, we're going to check out and see what Kazumi has to say, man. See if she's changed her ways. But by the title, no, she did not. <laughs> Let's get to it. I've actually been selling nudes, sending free nudes for people who send their Vax card. I Literally. saw that. I was She's like, very bro, well. like. Huh. I'm only five seconds into the video. And that's the first thing I hear. I've been selling or giving away nudes for people who show their vaccination card. I just, I, I need to run that back just to make sure I heard everything I heard correctly. Hold on, y'all. I've there actually been selling nudes, sending free nudes for people who send their vax card. I Literally. saw that. I was like Ladies and gentlemen, let's give her a round of applause. She is out there making the world a safer place. If you got your vaccination card, you can get some free nudes from Kazumi. Awesome. Saving the world. One titty at a time. I love it. <laughs> like, Very bro, well. Like, <laughs> no. I'm going to do the world a service. Like, get vaccinated. I'll send you me naked for free. Is like, that something you're fuck? passionate about, or do you just want to get picked up in some sort of hashtag cycle? That is so stupid. I truly, <laughs> what? I, everyone should get vaxxed. I don't, care about, should. I don't care what anyone like, thinks about that. Like, my cheerleaders yeah, over yeah, here. Like, mm. Get, get vaxxed, and sure. you'll see my like, wax pussy. What's the worst <laughs> thing? Oh, wait, what? Get vaxxed, and you'll see my wax I guess that's how easy it is, y'all. Get waxed, you see the vag. <laughs> Wait, what? I won't get vaxxed? <laughs> I mean, I wouldn't fuck a guy with no test results, so I probably yeah. wouldn't, like, hang out with a homie yeah. that wasn't vaxxed. It's, well, so, yeah, you if know, you have to get STD test. Okay, I can at least say, hey, she's not out here smashing everybody, you know what I'm saying? If you are going to have some sex... You, especially with a lot of different partners you want to make sure you get tested make sure they get tested make sure they show their results because you know hey that's a dangerous game you play so that's the one thing i can give her but she's still for the streets but she's for the vaccinated streets now i love it all 36 of those gentlemen have their cards on them this then pre-covid pre oh okay yeah. i'm sorry so another I timeline mean, was a wild woman COVID. and i can't speak for the past okay <laughs> So wait, so you, how has your life changed since we last had you on the show? Because you had like 60,000 followers, I think, at that time. And now you have like 300,000. I Damn. actually hadn't figured out how to accept everybody until a few weeks ago, which is why I just blew up. Because I finally just accepted everyone into mm -hmm. my Instagram. Damn. I did notice that it went up really quickly. And I, I was, was thinking like, that maybe oh, you bought some. But everyone okay. was waiting. I was going to yeah. let you live, though. I wasn't going to call you out. Yeah. Blew up everywhere, no. literally. Yeah. Um, my life. Because, man. Even though uh, us fellas know she for the street, there's some fellas that they can't resist getting some of that sweet Kazumi ass. <laughs> it's been good. I've been eating a lot. Obviously. Well, because you said something do, crazy we, happened we there. We did do like a, a squirt bukkake oh, on yeah, your friend's body. I mean, really describe really that. So, okay. Yeah, this is definitely going to be uh, limited ads. <laughs> 18 and older is only going to be able to watch this video unless I cut a lot out, but... 
Oh my god. Well, we were dressed up as nuns. Yeah. You know, of oh, course. because oh, let me introduce Ava. I'm sorry. Yeah, Hi, okay, Ava you got to tell us about your friend too Ava before we get too deep. More, so. Hi guys. Hello, hello. Where did you come from and how did you end up in her little prostitution network? Yeah, and then we'll talk about Well, she took nuns. on yeah. 10 guys in one night and then Kazumi <laughs> took her under her wing. Big <laughs> yeah, that, that's for a later story. Yeah, so, well, we met through like Twitter pretty much. Um, I mean, I started with like my Snapchat premium and all that, started going on like Twitter, Instagram and just like slowly trying to meet like other girls who do it too and then like kazumi we talked just hit it off so we've been like hanging out making content ever since then she's straight from the philippines yeah. so she wanted to be a oh, nun wow oh, yeah. so her yeah. ultimate wow. fantasy was to be in a nun orgy which is what we did yesterday yeah, oh my god bro a nun orgy bro i just, I just A nun orgy. People dressed up as nuns going around sucking and and you know what? Are you serious right now? Oh my. There you go. Which is why we had a nun squirt bukkake. Yeah, that was insane. I literally squirted on like a girl. It was like, like it was projectile. So, like yeah, a it was like... See, her just... OnlyFans is like if Jeff Bezos had an OnlyFans. <laughs> it was like we were all nuns and we were just reenacting her yeah, true life, which is just literally. being a bad shitty nun just like, in the know. Philippines. And then we had our... I don't we know, had like eight I don't people know how on that, this, so... This, you have to watch it. But yeah, like, you, you just have to wait. We all on squirted on this woman's body while she was screaming. It was like it was like it was the Exorcist, except with some, squirt. Who is the woman? Oh, well, our friend Kitty K fan. She is not here, I but that was, that's her. And Shout she's out. she's an attractive girl too. Of course. I, I didn't know if you found. Um, they're both from the Philippines. Yeah, Philippines. Mm -hmm. And yes. people they tend to associate Asian girls with pretty faces and just pretty unremarkable flat bodies. Right. But what Kazumi has done here is she's <laughs> created some sort of hybrid where uh -huh. she's she's got the figure of a black woman. Mm. on an Asian frame. It's like the best of both worlds, right? I'm loving it. That's why the streets love her so much. I think so. <laughs> yes, that is why the streets love her so much. Because she is for the streets. <laughs> Yo, this is crazy. Right. Well, problem, you could let a retarded guy <laughs> sit through a, a, a handicapped old man. I, I don't would, know. I would most things, you know. Most, th most things. I was telling Daniel. Oh. She said, I would fuck most things. <laughs> if that ain't the definition of a fucking street for the streets, I don't know what is, yo. Well, I've actually fucked white guys, but I have um, been celibate often. I'm a born again virgin with white guys. Technically, with my new body, no white guys. That's just I can't, I can't, I, the things that she is saying does not compute. I'm a born again version with only with white guys. What in the, what does that, how is that even a thing? You can't, you can't just be a born again version, a born again virgin with just a particular race. It's, interesting how that works. And this guy comes up to us and a bunch of our girlfriends and are like, hey, you want to do a gangbang? I'm just like, yeah. my fantasy. Said, Wait a minute. They came up to you in Vegas. What, on the strip? No, we were at the Cosmopolitan. Yeah. Were something. you in a club or were yeah. you at a yeah, blackjack we were, table? What were you doing here? We were just being hot girls. Yeah, pretty yeah, much. We were being, we were we were being Asian. Club, yeah. I guess it was a white guy. Okay. Uh, to, for the details. And I assume he had a suit on, looked like he wasn't. He looked like Santa Claus. Yeah. He, he was like, like an older guy. white man. <laughs> yeah. like a little chunky. And, you know, not to body shame. Okay. okay. Yeah. And anyways, we go up to his room. It's like eight of his girls. And we're like, wait, how are we going to gangbang you? And he we was like, one guy in a room, so. put on the strap on. And we obliterated his old man's booty hole, bro. Like, yeah. we like six hours. It was just of, crazy. Six hours just of like, like this, please give this, it. So my white guy, her gangbang. Why yeah. would you want to <laughs> obliterate? <laughs> what is? <laughs> this, is how, this is how boys get down. Put the strap on, you ladies. Obliterate me. Ooh. Hey, man. If you're into it, you got the money for it, do your thing. It's not for me. 
Oh my god. Everybody in the studio's <laughs> mouth is just a gape. That's nope. Uh, that my initial reaction there. I what? This is insane. What he can believe this. <laughs> I mean, he had me fucking missionary style in the ass. Whoa. And that's was, <laughs> Whoa. This is definitely going to be probably demonetized, but it's okay. Holy. Yo, this is fucking wild. The thing was so we were like, we're looking at each other like, eye contact, like, yeah. you, we were literally you like chink. face to face on that thing. Like, yeah, so we I were know. just strap on deep, fucking this old man's <laughs> little booty hole. <laughs> <laughs> it a big, I mean, he loved it though. <laughs> so. Big booty hole. How big was the strap on? Um, well, we all had our own yeah. types. He had like a little, like, um, little salsable or like little. He had an armory. Dildo. No armory. Yeah. And he came with the props. He came with the props. He knew what he wanted. He, he knew, oh yeah, my exactly. yeah, he god! Yeah, he wanted an Asian girl gangbang. Here is dumbfounded. I, I love it though. Any, I haven't gotten an opportunity for a, a, a white guy of your standards <laughs> to peg. If you would like us right. to peg, right? I know. I, I think like most normal guys wouldn't want to have that opportunity because they'd be like, I don't want anything on my butt or anything like right. that. Yeah, you know? but I would. I'm no. obsessive. What, ass, was, I love ass. it. Was this your religion. way of of stopping Asian hate? <laughs> like, is that partially what this was all about? This one's like. Pre-stop pre Asian hate time. Oh, Although, that's cool. yeah. So what she's a pioneer, is what yeah. you're saying. Yeah. <laughs> this was before our time. I mean, yeah. white oh, privilege wow. has to be destroyed one oh, way or another, know. right? Facts. Get, Get rid of white privilege. Get rid of white privilege by just obliterating somebody with some dildos. <laughs> I told y'all, man, at the beginning of this video, she is saving the world one dildo, one vaccination card at a time. She's still for the streets, though. Yeah, I was. He was like, he was yeah. also wearing a wig and a bra and stuff. And we yeah. were just like, oh. it's just like a whole. Oh, so different... he was trans. No, he was. So he was like, a woman. He's no, just... he was a man. <laughs> but he Sounds was... like a woman. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> but he was just, you know, having fun in Vegas. Yeah. yeah. Wow. Just wanted something different, you know. What a vibe! Yeah. Oh my god! Yeah, it was that really is... crazy. Yeah, but the scene was we were at a yoga. Yeah, it was like gone a yoga. Yeah. Gone right. Yoga. Yeah. Exactly. <laughs> yoga class gone right. Yoga already, gone yeah. wrong. Human centipede of yeah. eating pussy ass. It, it just turned into a workout to a human yeah, centipede Eliana kind of there. thing. I, no, no, she wasn't. No, she wasn't. No, she was here today. I would yeah. like to ask this, Kazumi, because you said when you came in and people who are watching, instead of just listening, will see that Kazumi is sitting on a modified Brazilian butt lift seat. Yeah. She cannot physically sit down, which yeah. begs the question, can you physically do yoga or exercise? No, so, oh, yeah, porn is fake. Guys. So I Wait, guess I didn't actually do yoga. You do <laughs> yoga with a butt pad? Uh, no, this was a fake porn yoga. This was, yeah. yeah so we, we only did, did like standing positions and, and, and it kind of just led to us eating pussy in the middle of it. <laughs> oh, so, of course. Just transitioning. Of <laughs> course. Wow. And I'm sorry to stay off the sex stuff, but I'm fascinated. Are you able to jog? Are you able to lift weights? What are the yeah. limitations with that? I'm able to do that, but it doesn't mean I will. So. <laughs> <laughs> you don't work out or anything? No, I oh, don't. No. I she... mean, I should. I'm going to get there. Sex exercise? Yeah. 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 Oh, you, uh, we do Asian that all the time, right? Yeah. Oh, we do that all the time. Time, so yeah I, I don't even know what to say to this other than yo this is she is wild that's funny <laughs> in the the next recommended video is my video reacting to me you know me reacting to uh my first time seeing her uh, on no jumper so it's funny that that's the next video uh, to check out. One of the next videos to check out. And then the thumbnail of that video, she is for the streets. She's still for the streets. Um, I I don't even know what to say, man. Yo, I, I'm, I don't have much to say. I don't. I, have, I don't have much to say here. Comment down below. Let me know. Would y'all get vaccinated just to see her nudes for free? Let me know if y'all would do that. Let me know if she's the deciding factor for some of y'all to finally get vaccinated. Appreciate all the love and support. Roll to 60K. Appreciate y'all kicking it with me. And I'll see y'all on the next one. Peace.